add for the audience, you know, this concept of thriving has come up over and over again. And of course, I think that's what we wish for, for ourselves and for the young people in our lives. Um, there are actually some very specific ways that you can think about thriving, and they include looking for a strong, affirming community, um, seeing whether or not there's spaces for young people to have their identities affirmed and ways for them to then articulate and self-assert their identities in that space, um, whether or not there are abundance of resources and even opportunities to do abundant things like dreaming and imagining and being creative. Um, pleasure, making sure that in, in balance with the academic rigor, there's vigor, there's the opportunity to live vibrantly and be joyful and um, even, as, as said before, to pursue passions and interests, to find a sense of purpose. Um, and of course, making sure that because these environments can have so many stressors and the context even of going to college can be stressful, that there are sources of relief for the family, for the student, um, and moments of respite. Um, and then finally, and this is the, like, if you can get it, it's amazing. Um, when people have those things all together, they have a tendency to experience the ability to just be and that's this magical space of existing without having your identity or your needs contested. And so when you think about thriving and you think about thriving at college, those are some ways for you to imagine what might be great for a, a young person or as a young person, what might be great for me.